In this video, I want to let you guys know about this new add-on called Scene Scanner by CG Matter, which basically lets you create 3D scans from ordinary images and videos, no fancy 3D laser scanners or any hardware required. So how does it do that? So what does Scene Scanner actually do? You just give it a video clip or a sequence of photos of some 3D scene or object, and it spits out a dense cloud of points that recreates your scene in 3D. Each point carries color from the images, so the point cloud looks recognizably like your object, almost like a pixelated whole scene. You see, a lot traditional photogrammetry, which painstakingly builds for 3D mesh models and take hours. This animal focuses just on points and overall structure, and it runs ridiculously fast. You won't get solid mesh out of it directly, but the trade-off is speed and simplicity. According to the developer, the videos tend to work great for mapping out large environments, say scanning your room by walking around with your phone camera, while a set of still images might capture a small object's details better. In either case, the atom processes your input and generates a point cloud with impressive density, with talking potentially millions of points to represent your scene. This density means you got quite a bit of detail in point cloud representation, and since each point is colored, it is much easier to recognize features in the scan. You see, speed is a huge selling point for this add-on, so what might normally take 30 minutes could be potentially done in just 30 seconds, but the quality depends on your input. It can achieve this boost by not overprocessing every tiny detail into a heavy mesh. Instead, it quickly maps up your scene as a cloud of points, capturing the big picture structure. And in practice, this means you can scan and get results almost on the fly, which can be a game changer for your workflow. If you need a quick 3D reference of your real world location, or maybe your scene, grab a quick video, run it through your scene scanner, and you will get a point cloud in Blender ready to help you guide your work. And of course this can be done in less time compared to photogrammetry pipeline. And this speed and ease of use can save you a ton of time and help you make progress faster. The add-on also comes with a few neat tools and options that make it fun and user-friendly. For instance, once your point cloud is generated, the add-on lets you crop out unwanted parts, I mean unwanted parts of the scan, so you are left with just the area or the object that you care about. You can crop using simple shapes like box, sphere, or maybe a cylinder to trim the point cloud, and it is all well integrated, so you don't need external editing or cleanup, I mean in other software. Another handy feature is the range of quality settings, if you want to check that too. Not everyone needs an ultra-dense scan every time, so Scene Scanner includes multiple quality levels for the depth estimation it uses. Out of the box, you can do quick low quality or maybe medium quality scans. And if you do need super high quality details, there are larger model files, a few gigs in size, so we can download that to push it to larger or maybe giant quality for finer depth accuracy. As you can see, this tiered approach means you can do faster previews and then switch to higher quality modes when you feel that you're ready and want more details. So if you are interested in this add-on, you will find all the necessary links in the description. And there you have it guys. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Also, please subscribe to this channel to receive more news videos like this. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you in the next one.